My name is Richard Burke. I'm a trainer with Chevron Training. I'm going to show you today how to commission a solar system. Uh, what we have here at the moment is uh, a Kingspan system. This is the main pump that drives the liquid up and down uh, from your solar uh, collectors above down to your cylinder. Okay. We're going to show you how to commission uh, a system properly with glycol. Uh, we'll show you this, uh, the system coming up here. We have a, a flow pipe here and a drain pipe right here. Okay. This is the fill point and this is the drain pipe point coming back. Okay. In theory, before you start, uh, all the power needs to be turned off. Okay. All power off on the system. Okay. So we're ready to fill through uh, our filling device. So what we do is we turn off this throttle valve parallel goes in parallel to horizontal which means that is off now okay so she is ready to be filled through the system so we start filling through the system here obviously this valve gets opened fills through the system here up into your pump up to your solar system back around again back down through your cylinder back around back out and into your tank and what we have here is every time this is pushing through here it has to push out the air has to push it out, okay? Once we see this running clear, at this, uh, maybe 20 minutes, we leave it run for, once it runs for 20 minutes, you should see all the air coming out at this stage, and at that point, you turn off your system, like so, okay? Turn off your system, and we open our throttle valve, again, wide opened, and now the system is back opened again. You bleed your air from here, you bleed your air from here, and also you might have an automatic air vent in the roof, and you bleed it from there as well. Okay, once you have that done, uh, what you do then is you go to your clock and you set it up onto on. Basically, what you're doing there is you're turning the pump back on. And once you turn the pump back on, you will see this little uh, flow meter here, okay? And it'll tell you how many liters per minute your fluid is passing, okay? Uh, every manufacturer will vary on the amount of liters per minute that you have, okay? Most of them will say a half a liter per square meter on the roof. That's a, that is the re recommended standard, okay? Once we set our flow meter uh, right here, and how you set it is you set it with the pump speed up and down here, set it with the pump speed, and as well as that, if you can't regulate it with the pump speed, you actually use your uh, throttle valve and turn it slightly. Once the required flow it is achieved, go back up here, turn it on to automatic, and generally you're ready to uh, go at that stage. 